Hey everybody, here we are at the Habitat Restore. This restore's hours are Monday through Saturday, 10 to 4, and you know by now I'm gonna link the address below. Oh, here we go. Here's a plush red and gold chair for $95. To me, it looks brand new. I love the fringe on the bottom. And like I've said before, check your ReStore for pillows. They had several of these pillows, $350 each. And here's a fancy gold floral camelback sofa for $300. Oh, I love that. I love the rolled arms, the wood on the front. And like I've said before, check your ReStore for artwork. So this is $28.50 and it's a huge medallion. It's got the burlap, it's got the rope. I love it. <laughs> I love, love it. And look, they actually had two of them. So they have these right up front and they were normally $79.95 at Pier 1. And this is a shot back through their dining room section. And here's a large black glass top coffee table for $150. And that's a metal base under it. Looks like a sculpture. And this was so soft. So this is a tan two cushion love seat for a little over $200 and it feels like that microfiber suede material and it looks brand new. And here's a fabulous bench. So I love just that caning on the back. I love the checked seats. It's a little over $400. I think that would be perfect as seating behind your dining room table. And here's a stained glass pendant for $25. And like I've said before, if you're on a budget or you want to save money, definitely check your ReStore. Here's a sofa for $85. Oh, and I gotta tell y'all, I met the sweetest couple coming up and they had their little dog with them and I love it. So I just want you to meet this sweet baby. So this is Keiko. Hey Keiko. So the owner told me that means blessing in Japanese. Hey, sweetheart. Oh, thank you so much. Y'all have a good day. Keiko was so sweet. She was enjoying her shopping trip at the ReStore. So I turned around and they had this fancy brown sofa for $200. And like I've said before, get those touch-up markers. Those little nicks and scratches are going to go away. And they had the love seat to match it. So this was a little less than $200. And here's a huge basket for $24. And here's some more of their artwork. This is a gallery wrap canvas for $5.50. And here's a leather sofa, love seat, and ottoman. I like that green color. And here's another medallion, $8.50. And I turned the corner and they had these chairs, $48. I love all those colors in them. And they had to pair them, $48 a piece. And you know how I love the swirly metals, so this candle sconce is $4.50. Okay, I think this would be the perfect cat bed. It's $28.50, it's a little baby doll cradle. I don't think my Ric Flair would sleep in it though. And here's a fancy shelf for $1.50. And here's another one for $2.50. And I really like this display cabinet, so it's $35. I just love that basket weave in the top. And I hope you can see it actually has a shelf in the middle of it. So I turned around and they have this table with the tablecloth for $15. And I thought this was fancy. So for $4.50, maybe this urn is where we could hide our secret papers. I don't know. <laughs> that might be too obvious. And definitely check your restore for cups or mugs. This big mug's a dollar. 
And you know, sometimes I find huge loads of things. So these little dessert cups, or maybe they could be tea light holders, they're 50 cents a piece. That'd be perfect if you're having a wedding. And I like this, the ABCs of life. So accept differences, be kind, count your blessings. And these are some canisters. So, oh, so weird it's gonna break them. So this large one's $3. And I like the neutral color, so the medium's two. And you know I'm gonna have to look at the price on the other one, $1.50. So you're not gonna have much money at all in a set of canisters. And I like this, so it's $10 for the entire set. And I hope you can see the fancy swirly design in the gold. And this table gives me an Ernest Hemingway vibe, $48. And that was actually a really sturdy table. And here's a small pillow for $2. You know I love that shabby chic look. This is a metal baker's rack for $60. I love the size of it, it's kind of compact. swirly middle on the sides and here's a close-up of those two gallery wrap canvases sitting on it they're 250 a piece okay if you're out there and your initials a they've got your fancy mug here it's a dollar And you know we've got to look through these cookbooks. They go anywhere from 75 cents up to $1.25. Let's see, Women's Edge, Smart Food, Savory Strategies to Divide Disease. That would be a good one. Grill it up, you know it's that time of year. Oh, great taste, low fat grilling. Sign me up for that one. Ooh, that looks yummy. Oh, and great taste, low fat chicken. Binge watching eats. <laughs> we probably need to stay away from that one. Oh, the ultimate 30 minute cookbook. This was a really heavy book, so it's got 10 minute recipes, 20 minute, 30 minute. And chocolate lovers cookies. What is it with me in these cookie cookbooks? <laughs> No, 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 I gotta stay away from those. Oh, and here, the delicious, what does it say? Delicious ways to control diabetes. I probably need that one. So anyway, I hope y'all will check out your cookbooks at the ReStore. And I liked this sign. So it's actually made out of metal and that's carved into it. Embrace the rhythm of the season. And this was just so cute with the white lab holding the wine on his nose. <laughs> And I found this cute little water bottle, so it's metal, a dollar. I love that design on it. You know, those can be really expensive. And here's one of those items waiting to be prized. You can't buy it today. You gotta come back the next day to see what the price is. They entice you to come back, but I love this wine rack. And I think this is a fancy office chair with that nail head trim and the chrome. It's $25. Oh, and I gotta tell you, I turned the corner. Look at this. So this is part of their antiques and unique section. These chairs are dreamy. Oh, I love them. Somebody said they have a Spanish flair. Somebody said they're gothic. You guys will have to let me know. What do you think about these chairs? So they're definitely older. We weren't exactly sure kind of what period they were. That actually feels like some type of vinyl on the back. And the seat actually feels like some type of velvet. So I don't know. And they swivel. They're really heavy. I love that design. I thought they were gorgeous. And here's a beautiful dish from France. That's so pretty. So it's $20 and they're calling it a Limoges.
And this is a little dish from Austria. These are actually fishbone dishes, fancy little fishbone dishes, $1.50 a piece. I would use those as soap dishes in my bathroom. And this is a Homer Laughlin sugar and creamer set for $20. You know I love those flowers. And here's a piece of hand-painted vintage Stingle pottery for $20. And this is the stamp on the back of it. It says hand-painted in Trenton, USA. And I found a Surla table casserole dish made in Italy, $18. I hope you can see that beautiful blue color. And I looked these up online. They typically go for like $50 to $75 a piece. And here's a sweet little creamer. I love those blue flowers on it. And it's by St. Andrews. And they've got it here for $2.50. And here's a floral pitcher for $2. Johnson Brothers, England. I think that would be perfect in your bathroom for a toothbrush holder. And I turned around and I found this wooden mantle for $95. I love those chips in it. I wouldn't do any touch-ups on it. I think it's perfect the way it is. And here's a really soft sofa for $175. I love that gray color, just a nice neutral. And this is probably the largest leather recliner I've ever seen. It's $150 and it's actually a power motion recliner. And here's a vintage wooden rocker with the cushion for $60. I thought that was really unique just with a little, I guess, footrest in the front. And they've got this original piece of artwork by B.H. Brody for $200. I know that sounds like a lot, but look up B.H. Brody original art pieces, and they had two here go for way more money. Here is a brand new charbroil grill they've not put out for sale yet. You gotta come back tomorrow to see what the price is. It's back behind that chain. You know I get in trouble back there, but you know I gotta snoop around for us. And I like this blue armchair for $24. And here's another fancy pillow for $12. Again, it gives me that shabby chic vibe. And this is so pretty. I think this picture will be pretty behind your coffee bar or your tea bar. I think it was $8. And this is a tea light holder for $6.50. And here's another shot around the store. And you know when you shop your Habitat Restore, you're helping someone else with home ownership or home repairs. These are really pretty candle holders. These are $8.50 a piece. And here's some wicker furniture for $600. You get all four pieces. And you know we've got to look through this Restore Silent Auction item. So number eight is a Dutch oven set. And number seven is a silver on copper set. It's got the teapot, creamer, sugar, and vintage coasters. And number six is albums. I see some Elvis. Oh, I always wanted to see Elvis. And they've got the Eagles, and they've got the Doobie Brothers, and of course Michael Jackson. And number five is McDonald's glasses, the Flintstones, and Batman. And number four is vintage books circa 1953 and 1941. And that one is actually a calligraphy book. And number three is face jugs and a pottery dish by Mary Irvin. And these are highly collectible. Number two is a first and flat watch. And number one is a vintage Pyrex collection from the 1970s. Number nine is a Drexel Heritage Lamp Table. And number 10 is a Mid-Century Modern Drexel Cabinet. And number 11 is a Drexel Cedar Chest from the late 60s to the early 70s. So I hope y'all had fun with me today just for a quick trip through the ReStore. 
So I wanted to showcase this sign I found. It says, there are no strangers here, only friends we haven't met. And that's how I feel about each and every one of you. I feel like y'all are my friend. You know, we've not met, but I feel like we know each other. I appreciate your comments. I always look forward to y'all stopping by my channel. And I hope everyone has a wonderful day. So until next time, come go with me today. Bye. Okay, P.S. I bought something. I wanted to show y'all. I bought those wall hangings. I love them so much. I actually left the store. I went out. I set my vehicle and I thought, oh, should I resist? I, I, I don't need to take those home with me. But the more I thought about it, I was like, oh, I got to get them. I'm never going to see them again. So I went back in. I got them. They're at my house. I don't know where I'm going to put them. They're huge. Oh, but I love them so much. So I just want to let you know. So, okay, for real. Bye now.